Hey guys, it's Starburst Simmer, and welcome back to part two of The Sims 4 Spa Day. So, where we left off, we were in Create a Sim, and now we're gonna start in like live mode. But before we do that, we're gonna go check out some of the new items that this set came with. So, we're gonna go to Spa Day, and as you can see, there's a lot of items. So, we're gonna look through those. So first we have a clothing hook, which, okay, well it has to be placed on a wall, so let's just go there. And there you go, a clothing hook. Next up we have this sign right here, and it has a little spa day symbol on it. Very nice. Next, we have this Oatman here. Peaceful poor Oatman. And then, then we have this solitary stool right here. This common collected chair. It's a very nice chair. Then there's a happy hands and feet chair, which I believe you can actually do like massages on but like head or like feet massages that's what I'm guessing next is this chair in the corner then we have the sleek juice bar stool the posteriors website respite I mean <laughs> then we have the why would anyone sit on this I think this is a bench. Yeah. Then we have the simple Ottoman. Oatman. Right here. Then we have this. The relaxer massage ch table. Then we have this. Joe Series Island Style Counter 5B. And then we have the Joe Series Tileable Countertop 7A. And lastly, we have the Joe Series Modular Cabinet 4C. And you'd have to place that on a wall. Like that. Then we have the, m the Modern Mushroom Table. Next up, we have the Nouveau Re Rich Niche Table. And then we have the Hollow. I'm assuming it's a table. Awesome Cube. The waterfall sink, and I think this looks really cool because, like, it's hollow on the inside, and it looks really cool. Next up, we have the too cool for number two toilet. Then we have the tranquil waters shower, yeah. <laughs> and then we have the spa tub, which is a little round tub, and it looks adorable. Next up, we have the perfect tub, which is a cube tub. And then we have the Zen Again yoga mat, and I believe these are the yoga mats that, like, actually, you can actually do yoga on. They're not just regular carpets. And then we have the introspective contemplation stool, which I think you do meditation on, and there's another version right here. Next is this bar, and it's called Juicy L200 Liquid Beef Bar. And it's very pretty. Then we actually have two fish tanks, which is so cool because I loved using the fish tanks in The Sims 3. And now they have them for The Sims 4. So this one is called Swimming with the Fishies. And it's adorable. Then we have this one is Perfect Private Aquarium. Right here. Oops. Right here. And it's adorable. Then, we have two different saunas, so we have the Artificial Fever Room Sauna, and it's like made out of wood. Then we have the Stone Zone Sauna, and it's made out of stone. <laughs> Next up, we have the Don't Quit Boxing Bag, so this would be perfect for the gym. Then we have the Sprint Chic, and I think this is a fancy treadmill. 
I'm guessing. Then we have the Schick Grunt right here. Then we have the Lux Drink Tray. A plant. A Wheatless Wheat Grass. A Cherry Cherry Twigs Vase. A Budding Calm Vase. A Mini Zen Planter. A Palladative Potted Bamboo. The Beguiling Bamboo Divider. The Zen Again Wall Decal. And it looks like that on the wall. Then we have the As the Wall as the world turns mirror and it looks like this hold on like that then we have the ach mirror and i think it's just like a larger version right there then we have the backlit mirror of illumination like that then we have the precarious and I don't know what this is. I think it's just a sculpture, but... Then we have the Glass and Glaze and Grace Glazed vet Vase. Then we have the Small Free for All Water Fall. The Free for All Water Wall. And the Deluxe Free for All Water Wall. Next, we have the Modish Monolith. And it's a big block. Then we have the Soap Keeper, the Harmonious Oils and Ointments, we have a Pyramid of Observation Towels, Hori Marmut Wood Slacks Rug, Slats Rug, then we have the Laid Back Towel Rack, a Thumbs Over Paint Splotch, a Eclipse Wall Mount, the juiced up wall display. The foot illumination system. A foot illumination system corner edition. So I think you could just like place this on the ground and make like a little pathway, which would look really pretty at night. Then we have a Centrum Heaven incense holder. A Spring Blossom incense holder. An Ethereum wooden slat wall. Looks like this. Then we have a dar bright dark triplet totem candles. And the holy moly divider. I think this one's really pretty. I can totally say like this in a spa and it looks so pretty and nice. Then we have the illuminated lotus. And it's a little flower rug. A Your Logo Here Joe's Lighted Column. A The Light Antiquity. The Illuminate. The Stellar Spiral. Brushed Metal Square Wall Light. A Strip Away the Darkness Vertical Wall Light. A Single Strip of Light. Like that. And we have The Light Fantastic, which is even larger. And then it doesn't fit on this wall, but then we have the polished steel rectangular light. Looks like that. A shiny brass metal strip wall light. Slick beats by DJ Soduku in its little stereo. And then we have a good vibrations wall speaker. A Doc Sweets lukewarm tonic dispenser, which I think is this is a fridge. Yes, it's a fridge. Then we have the color block locker station and the one with everything locker. So these are the items that came with this set. And I think there's some build by items, but I'm gonna, yeah, there is. So there's this door and it's a little see-through door. There's this door and it's a larger door, a double door right here. And then there's a male bathroom and a female bathroom door. There's some new windows. So there's this one, 
and it's called the unspringing window then there's the nice icy frosted glass window and there's like if you can see there's like these little frosted things on them and it looks super cute then there's the flocked two times one window and it's a larger window like that and it also has like the ice stuff on it which looks really really cool and I think there's a new fence yes whoops so there's this fence right here the tranquil divide and I think it's just a fence yeah it's just like this plain glass fence and there's no new oh there is so there's some new wallpapers let's just look yeah there is so there's this one and it's a little stone one this one this one the rectangular flows one the ridiculous rectangular runner then we have the this one and this one's like I can see this being used in like a kitchen and it would look really really nice then we have a minimal slats a steamy sideways slats a steamy slats again <laughs> then we have a concrete idea which is just concrete and the glow that flows wall panel and this one looks really cool and it comes in some pretty colors it almost looks like a green screen in this color or maybe even in like this color here all right so I think that's it for the build by portion I'm just gonna double check we saw that already all right yeah so I think that's pretty much it so whoops we're gonna get into live mode here with our sims and I'm gonna do a little introduction for all of them so first up we have we have Isabella Davis right here oops all right and she is a perfectionist active materialistic and a high metabolism and her kind of backstory was that she grew up with a lot of money and they do all sorts of like activities and she really loved to do like yoga and go to the spa and get pampered and then she met her husband right here Hayden Cruz and Hayden is ambitious active good and gargarious and his little backstory is that he was always like he loved to play sports and he was very athletic and loved to do like he was on the captain of like every team and then they just met and fell in love and they had a daughter called Justine Davis and she is cheerful she's like very rambunctious and loves to like play outside so when she was younger Isabella used to bring her to the spas and she used to be calm down and they used to do like yoga together and stuff like that and this sim Casey Carter right here she she is um, Isabella's best friend but Casey recently lost her job and lost her house so Isabella said you know what you can come and stay with us till you get a job and get back on your feet so this is the family and we are currently living in this house right here it is a let's just see who this is by this is a family favorite by Daisy Forest 97 and I'll leave the link down below so if you like this house you can download it for yourself so going back into the house now if we go down so starting off starting off through the door there's a staircase and then to the left 
There's a dining room area, then there's a bathroom, a kitchen right here, then there's like the living room area, and then you go up a floor, you can see that there's a bathroom, then there's Isabella and Cruz is room right here, and then there is Justine's room here. And finally, there is Casey's room right here. And yeah, I like this house because like it's not too big but not too small. So it's a good size. So we're going to start off by sending all of them to the spa. And I put down all the spa like lots and the gym that go with this set. So we're just going to have them all go to the spa. So I put down this one, that one, and then this one. So we're going to do this. Alright, so here we are in the spa. And I just want to take a look around. This is my first time looking at it. So, if you go here... So you walk in here and there's a very nice reception area with a waterfall in the background and this looks so cute. Then back here there's like a little lobby with a little water fountain thing right there. And then if you go make your way over here there's a bar so you can have your drinks and there's a tray right there. Then there's some more seating. Then over here, there's like the prep room, so there's the showers, the lockers, which I hope they actually work. I think they do. And they do, so yay. And then there's one for girls and one for guys, I'm assuming. Then upstairs, there... Wait, did I miss anything downstairs? Oh yes, I did. Okay. Then over here, there's a meditation room. And it has some little meditation things on them. And then, as we were going upstairs, there's a yoga room, which looks really cute. Right here. And then there's this mud bath thing. So you can take a mud bath and bath with soaks. And then, over here, there's the sauna, and it looks really, really nice. I'm gonna have to test that out. Then, there is the athletic room right here. There's a massage, well, two massage tables right there. Then, there's the little mini massage chairs right here. Another massage table, and another massage table. So we're going to have to test this stuff out. So we're going to start the bottom with our sims. I don't know what I want to do first, but we're going to test this out with Isabella and see what. So let's start off. You can go in here and change into rope. I think that's what they're all doing. See if Justine can do anything. Yeah, she can change into robe too. So she's gonna do that. So they're all gonna change into a robe. Alright. So now let's see what So she can take a mud bath too. And I don't think she can do yoga, sadly. Yeah, she can't do yoga, but she could take a mud bath. She can go in the sauna, so we're going to have her go in the sauna. And see what that looks like. Whoops. Alright. So she looks like she's having a good time in here. Looks like she's having fun. 
So you can't actually do anything. You can just relax in the sauna, I think. Let's test it out. They can actually woohoo or try for a baby in here. So we may do that. When Justine's not in the sauna, though. Alright. So we're gonna have Isabella join energy scenting yoga class. Yoga class. And then... Hayden Cruz, well, well, he's already doing the treadmill right here. I want to see him do this thing. So let's let's see what this interaction looks like. So it looks like that. <laughs> looks like he's having a grand old time. Then, we're gonna have Casey try out the massage chair right here. So, she's gonna request a foot massage by Anne Vagaline Black. And let's see how the yoga... Oh, she's not doing yoga now. Alright. Can she join the class? No. It started already, so she's gonna actually take a so bath with soaks, and she's gonna soak with milk, honey, and oatmeal soak. I'm not gonna be able to get in there, so... Looks like that. She has her mask on. And it looks super cute. Alright. Now Justine is changing back into a robe. But I think she's already in a robe. So I want to see if the children can meditate. If that's a thing. Let's check this out. And they can't. So basically the only thing she can do is go into the sauna. Or take a bath so she's gonna do that she's gonna take a mud bath and she is going to ask to start yoga class we're gonna do a brain boost yoga class all right and Casey is on the treadmill and I wanted her to have a foot massage but I think I missed it so we're gonna try her again and let's see how that looks. Okay, so she's gonna get a foot massage now. It looks like that. Looks like she's having a fun time. And that's what that looks like. Now she's doing some yoga. So this is what the class looks like. Looks so cool now that they're all together. Doing it all as one. She's actually pretty good. So it looks like that. And then we're gonna have Hayden. Oh, he's already in the sauna. Oh. One step ahead of me. And she just finished that. So, this is what it looks like when children have a mud bath. And she's done. Let's see. Mud is magic from taking a mud bath. Somehow, the squishy, icky mud has rejuvenated Justine's confidence. Who's ready to take on the world? She is... And we're going to have Justine go back into the sauna. So there isn't much for her to do. Casey is working at her thing here. And she's actually going to go into the sauna. Alright. Alright. 
the yoga looks really, really cool. She's not that good at that pose, but that's okay. She'll get better. I have faith in her. And this is my favorite pose right here. Lie down on the ground one. All right. So these three are in the sauna. <sighs> Looks really relaxing. <laughs> and I think when Isabella is done, she's gonna get a massage. Yes, she's done. And she's gonna get a. She's gonna get a fertility massage. And these one the fertility massage actually increases your chances of having twins or triplets. So we're gonna try that. And see what happens. Looks very relaxing. <laughs> and she's done. So I don't know if that did anything. Yes. Fertility boost. The blood is boiling from vitality and procreative energy. So we're going to actually have them try for a baby now. Because the sauna's empty. So we're going to do that. Are they not going to do that? What's he doing? Let's try this. Yes, they're going to go try for a baby. In the sauna. And it looks like this. I wonder if she'll actually get twins from getting that massage. I hope she can I hope she does. So in the next parts we can figure that out. Ooh. Looks pretty cool. And they're done. <laughs> And he got a mood lit. It says hot and steamy from Woohoo. Woohooing builds up a sweat, but in a sauna it takes it to an, a, a whole new level. And I think she got the same one. Yeah, she did. And she also got a pleasantly satisfied mood lit. So, there you go. We're going to have them try out one of these drinks right here. Just to see if they get a mood lit. And Casey is feeling energized. And we're going to have Casey try another type of bath. So we're going to do a rose petal bath. And Isabella, she's enjoying her drink right here. She looks super happy. Really happy to be drinking it. We're going to take a screenshot. Oh, right. I said yes. I don't know what that means, but she looks really cute. I'm gonna take another one just because she's so adorable. All right. So now let's go see what these bubble bath thing looks like. So there's some rose petals in the bath, and it looks really relaxing. <laughs> it looks like that. Again, she has the face mask, so I think they're all pretty much like that. And what are they doing? They're chatting in the sauna. <laughs> looks like she's just annoying him. Oh well. 
and Isabella. She got a moodlet, so it says, Ah, uh, refreshing from drinking fizzy, fruity drink. What a better way to enjoy a day of relaxation than with a refreshing drink. So it's getting kind of late, so we're going to send them all home. So, travel. Oh, so we're going to have Hayden, Justine, and we're going to have them all travel together and send them home. So, alright guys, so I think I'm going to end this part here, and in the next part we should see if she is pregnant with, if, if she's pregnant, and if it actually worked. So, I hope you enjoyed this part. If you'd like to subscribe or leave a comment, you can. Okay, bye!